Ladies and gentlemen, this is the mysterious bag of mystery. When you put your money in, it disappears. Wow, that sounds legit. Yeah, I put my money in. Oh yeah, totally. <laughs> Losers. <laughs> Okay, usually I'm not a bored person, but today I am bored. Yeah, <laughs> uh, me too, Mabel. Whoa. Hmm. <sighs> wow, this chapter is really interesting. <sighs> Mabel, what is it? I don't know. It's, I'm really bored today. There's nothing really to do, I feel like. Oh, well, I'm not bored. Because you're reading that journal. I have nothing to do. Uh, maybe go play with your pig? He's bored, too. Uh... <laughs> oh, well, uh, how about you make another sweater? I'm not like Mabel in the show. I only own one. Right. Yeah, you know what? I don't think there really is anything we could do today. It's kind of too hot out. <sighs> yeah. I guess we'll just sit on the couch and be bored. Exactly. <sighs> so bored. Hey, what's up, guys? Whoa. Who? Almost uh, tripped over your pig there, Mabel. <laughs> Ank. Hey, Sus. Yeah, hey, Sus. What's wrong, Hambones? I don't know. It's just it's too hot to do anything today. Uh, other than read my book. <laughs> I'm glad we do that. Dipper. <laughs> oh, yeah, I feel you. It is really hot out there today. Well, you guys are in luck. When I was cleaning, I actually found Stan's old TV. <gasps> really? Oh, boy, internet. <laughs> oh, boy is right. I'm going to go hook it up. <laughs> uh, there you go. Whoa. Turn it on. On a hand bone. Uh. Get your new and improved night guard squisher. Busting down that door is a breeze. Now you can whack and kill even faster. Call 908 Squish em Hard right now for exclusive offer. Why are Gravity Falls ads so cheesy? <laughs> I know, right? They may be cheesy, but dear children, that is what makes them superior. Right. Oh my god, not this commercial. Stan, look, it's cheesy just like your merchandise. Hey, my merchandise is better than that crap! <laughs> <sighs> oh, hey, look, it's that commercial I was telling you guys about. Are you completely miserable? <laughs> yes! <laughs> then you need to meet... Gideon. Gideon? What makes him so special? He's a psychic. Huh? So don't waste your time with that so-called man of mystery. Learn about tomorrow tonight at Gideon's Tent of Telepathy. There are many words from the past and you're aware that you cannot read them. Deal with it. Thank you. Whoa, I'm getting all curiousy inside. Eh. Well, don't get too curiousy. Ever since that monster Gideon rolled into town, I've had nothing but trouble. Well, is he really psychic? Hey, it's inside. I think we should go find out. Never! You are forbidden from patronizing the competition. No one that lives under my roof is allowed under that slimy reptile's roof. Uh, do tents have roofs? Guess we'll have to find out. Whatever! Whatever! So, come on down, folks! Gideon is expecting you. <laughs> Pretty legit. 
I fell for it twice. This man's got some nice hair. <laughs> like a bizarro version of the mystery shack. Oh, it's so cute in here. Come on, sis. Come in, dude. This place is pretty cool. Do we just like sit down or? Yeah, I guess so. <clears throat> I'm ready. <gasps> I think it's starting. Think. I'm officially terrified. Aw, oh, like enough, bro, bro. I think he's cute. <sighs> oh, well, hello there, folks. My name's Liz Gideon. Okay, well, one, now he's Afro, and two, the name's kind of a lie. You're uh, really huge. Yeah, I get that a lot, boy. You know, it's supposed to be ironic. Fine, make a scaly old me or something. I sure am slippery. Anyways. <sighs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is such a gift to have you all here tonight. Such a gift. I have a vision. I predict that you will all say aww. Ready? Aww. It's so cute. What? I'm not impressed. You are impressed. Hit it, Dad. All right, son. Wait, that's his father? How? I don't know. I guess they're both green, so. Yeah, yeah, that explains it. Oh, yo, my name is Gideon and I'm here to stay. I can guess your random crap any day. Yeah, those awesome sick plushies, man, they're really dope. Ooh, Blubs, he likes our plushies. Ooh, I told you he'd notice them, darling. However, do they look like me? <laughs> nope. Kind of look like Marty, not gonna uh, lie. Uh... All right, everyone, start beatboxing with me. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, we smooth. Oh my god, this is embarrassing. All right, y'all can stop. Take it away, Dad. All right, son. All right, I'm gonna get some more things. Now I bet you wish you had a snack. Oh, very wise, very wise indeed. I do want a snack. Well, I'd get you some, but I think they're all back and I don't feel like going out there. Yeah! Though I might be wrong, there might be some food on the table. Boom. Cool. And well, something tells me your name is Mabel. Woo! So magical. Wait, what? How? Hey! Woo! Yay! Yay! We love you, Gideon! You see, folks, I can see things that you can't see. The unknown is a mystery. Now you too would see. Well, if you were scaly old me. <laughs> that was really fun. Thank you, y'all, for coming. I still can't believe that thing is Stan's mortal enemy. Like, what? I thought he was cute. His little dance moves were adorable. It's kind of freaky he knew your name, though. Like, that's kind of weird. It was probably just a lucky guess. Mabel, how the heck would he guess that? Because he's psychic. <laughs> yeah, that explains it. <laughs> yeah, well, it was still pretty weird. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let's go back to the shack. Yeah, you're right. Come on, Seuss. Hmm. Seuss, what are you doing? Uh huh. Oh, sorry, Hamboon. Uh, he said there might be like snacks on the table or something. I'm just checking. <laughs> oh, Seuss. <laughs> Come on, Seuss. All right, all right. Huh. Dipper, look! I successfully bedazzled my face. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay then. Ow. Is it Norman again for round two? I'll go get it. I'll get it! H and never mind. Hello! Oh, Jesus, watch the eyes, girl! Wait, Gideon? Wait, the little psychic boy? Yep, it's just scaly old me. <laughs> um, what are you doing here? 
Well, you see, after last night, I just couldn't stop thinking about you. Um, okay. Well, I was just wondering if maybe you wanted to hang out for a little? Okay, where? Like, here? Oh, just around the town. It'll be fun. Um, well, uh, I don't know. Oh, please, Mabel, you'll make me so happy. Um, sure, I guess. Oh, thank you so much. It'll be so fun. Come on! Yay. <laughs> When I'm up here with you, Mabel, looking down on the town, I feel powerful. <laughs> yeah. Listen, today was super fun. Uh-huh. And, well, you see... Uh-huh. I was meaning to ask you something. Yeah? Mabel, would you go on a date with me? A play date? No. A shopping date? It'll just be one little old date. I'll swear on my lucky polo tie. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess. <gasps> oh, thank you, thank you! <laughs> so wait, what happened again? Gideon asked me out on a date, a real date! I don't think I'm ready for this! Wait, the slimy green booger with the white puffy hair? Yes, Dipper, but after Norman, I don't think I'm ready for this. Like, he's nice and all, but uh, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, uh, if I were you, I'd take a break, because gnomes were freaking terrifying. But I already said yes. Ugh, I don't know. Well, it's just one date, right? <sighs> yeah. Well, then that's fine. You should leave you alone after that. Okay, but... What if he catches feelings? Let's not worry about that right now. <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, it should be fine. If he's happy, I'm happy, right? Whatever you say, Mabel. <sighs> <gasps> Your Chapman awaits, my good lady! Nay. Whoa. Yup, he's insane. <sighs> You're too short for this. Wow, uh, you're, uh, kind of famous here. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you could say that. It's pretty great. <laughs> Yeah, great. Ah, so Gideon and the Miz, can I offer you anything to eat tonight? Why do I sound French? Is this French? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I'll have something to eat. Uh, what do you have? Ah, the fanciest of the fancies for you, miss. <laughs> oh, so, uh, no pizza then? Yeah, what is that? Uh, never mind. I will take the red lobster extravaganza, please. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll just have what he's having. <laughs> ah, yes, very good selections from a very good couple. Uh, we aren't a couple. Oh, you are so sweet. We are flattered. <laughs> Anytime. Can I interest you in anything else? Oh, uh, no, but, uh, what if I told you about not looking me directly in the eyes? Uh, sorry, Sir Gideon. Whoa, whoa, uh, yeah, I got them. <laughs> I got them. Oh. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> <sighs> okay then. Wow, people just do whatever you tell them to do? Oh, Mabel, it's just because I'm so irresistible. <laughs> right, yeah. Listen, Mabel, tonight was an honor. I'm so happy that you joined me. Yeah, I'm happy to be here, Gideon. It's just, I was wondering if you would want to come to the Gravity Falls ball with me? It's just that we're like the golden couple in town. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my gosh, this is adorable. Come here. Oh my gosh, Gideon's asking her out to the ball. I, uh... Mabel, the town loves us. Will you do them a favor and join me? Um... Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. Gideon has a girlfriend. If she says no, I'll die. Honestly, though, like, if you did, who would care? Oh, come on, Mabel, everyone's waiting. Sure. I mean, I guess. <gasps> Mabel Pines, you have officially made me the happiest boy in the world. Yeah. Huh? Oh, you're back. How'd it go? 
What's wrong? <sighs> Mabel. I didn't want to be mean. How can I say no? Like this. No. It's not that easy, Dipper. Wait, did Gideon ask you out again? Mabel. I'm sorry. I just can't say no. Now we have to suffer. You know what? If you can't say no, Mabel, I'll do it for you. Wait. Really? <sighs> yes. Really. <gasps> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you! Alright, alright. Let me up. You're the best, Dipper! Alright, come on, Waddles. I'm gonna go bedazzle your face. Enormous. <laughs> Wait, what are you doing here? I requested the other one. Listen, I'm sorry, man. It's just, uh, Mabel does not like you anymore, and she will not be seeing you again. That's it. She has literally no feelings for you. Oh, so what you're saying is you came between us? What? No, Mabel wants it this way, alright, man? Jeez. Freaking weirdo. So you told him no? And everything's fine? Yep, everything's back to normal. Oh, thank God. Thank you, Dipper. Anytime, Mabel. Hmm. We have a phone? Dang, got a TV and a phone. I'll answer it. Hello? Hi, um, it's Gideon. Um, I just wanted to let you know, uh, Dipper, that I'm truly sorry if I, uh, if I sound threatening back at the restaurant. <laughs> Who is it? It's Gideon. Oh. Okay, well, I was just, like, wondering if you'd maybe want to, uh, come down to my, uh, my dad's factory, and, uh, maybe I could properly apologize. <laughs> you know. Um, alright then. I'll be there in a few. Good, great, I'll see you there, bunny boy. <laughs> <sighs> was he mad? No, he, uh, just said that he wanted me to, um, to go to his dad's factory, and he can properly apologize? I'm not sure. Oh, well. Um, that's cool, I guess. <sighs> well, I'll go sort it out. Just stay here, I'll be back. Alright, uh, be careful, bro. Hello? Slimy reptile thing. Where are you? So stupid. Um. Hello? Uh, hey man, so you wanted to properly apologize? We were happy together. Dude, you're like literally four. We were happy together! And you came between us. Come on, man. I told you before. Mabel's not into you. She thinks you're creepy, okay? Jeez. Creepy? Creepy? I'll show you, creepy boy. <sighs> Whoa! What the? <sighs> oh, where is he? It's been too long. <sighs> Uh, this is bad. Maybe I should have told Gideon myself. Hey, sweetie! Do you know where your brother is? I need to, um, ask him if he wants to, uh, hang up some more signs in the spooky parts of the forest. <laughs> no, um, he's not here, actually. You know what? I probably shouldn't be here, either. Oh, listen. I know depression is a hard thing, but you're worth it. Always remember that. Wait, what? No, I'm not depressed. Ow! Uh, never mind that, then. <laughs> it's just... Something bad is about to happen, and I can feel it. Y you know, Grunkle Stan? I feel like I should help it from not happening or something. 
Listen, kids, spill the beans. You're not your usual happy self. What's wrong? <sighs> I went on a date with Gideon, and he said that it was just going to be one little old date, and I said yes, and I went, and then he asked me out again, and I didn't know what to say, so I felt bad, and I said yes again, and then I regretted it, so Dipper told him for me, and uh, Gideon just called to me Dipper outside of his house or whatever to apologize or whatever, and uh, and Dipper went there, and uh, he's been gone for a while now, and now I feel guilty because I, I really should have went and told Gideon that I don't have feelings for him in the first place. <gasps> <clears throat> Okay, wait, you went on a date with Gideon? Mabel, seriously? Listen, Grunkle Stan, I didn't really like him. He was, he's more of a little sister than a boyfriend. You know what? I'm done with that whole family. You know, freaking Bud Gleeful and Gideon Gleeful can get a life and stop copying mine. Huh? I'm gonna go tell myself. That's the better option, right? Huh? Look, Gideon, I'm sorry I couldn't have the courage to tell you this myself, but I'm not into you. Oh my god. Dipper! Mabel! Wait, Mabel? You don't like me? Yeah, well, of course I don't, especially now, what the heck? Well, uh, uh, I... It's over, Gideon. <sighs> um... Uh, Gideon? <laughs> Mabel! <laughs> Dipper! Okay. You stupid rabbit! <laughs> <laughs> Slimy witch. My powers! My precious powers! Good job, Mabel. Thanks. I'm not defeated yet. This isn't the last time you'll see scaly old me. Oh. Welp, I'm officially done with dates for a long time. <sighs> yeah, right. I know you, Mabel. Heck, you'll probably have a new boyfriend next week. Eh, maybe onto something. You didn't find anyone yet? Eh, well, no, not yet. And when I do get a girlfriend, for the record, she's not gonna be as weird and freaky as those freaking gnomes and that lizard with the huge hair. Those powers were useless. Useless, I tell you. <gasps> they were pathetic. Well, then I guess you don't deserve the book, then. No, no, I need it. What are you talking about? I'm worthy, I promise. taking that. Thank you very much. No! I'm nothing without my powers! Please! Just return them back to me. I'll do whatever you say. Don't worry about it. It'll all work out in the end. You'll get your revenge. I promise, kid. Alright. I'll trust you. Thank you, Bill.